Hey there, and what's up everyone, and welcome to Web Folksters 5 Minute Monday Fun Day, where in this video for this Monday, we're going to take five minutes to combine WordPress, WooCommerce, and Amazon into a nice tasty WordPress website where site visitors make purchases and you get a small commission for doing that. Sound like something you're interested in? This video is for you, so stick around. <laughs> everyone. I'm Topher McGuire with Web Folkster and on this channel I like to bring out the latest and greatest information so businesses, agencies, individuals, entrepreneurs can get the most out of their digital marketing. I share tips, tricks, hacks, and strategies on everything from web design and app development to social media advertising, pay-per-click, and everything in between. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. And by the way, at any time during the video, check out the description below where I list out all my resource notes, related links, and information that I talk about in the video. So now, let's get started. As you can see, I have a fresh WordPress install here. I'm gonna be moving fairly fast, so I put the step-by-step -step instructions in the description below. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go ahead and head on over to Amazon and sign up for their affiliate program. It's called Amazon Associates. Once you create the account there and get approved, you'll now be able to begin to link products into your WordPress, WooCommerce, Amazon affiliate-based WordPress website. And I know I said WordPress twice, but anyways. So moving right along, after you establish your affiliate account, we're going to install the theme, WooCommerce, and all the other related plugins. And I'm gonna, like I said, move fast. So first thing I'm gonna do is install the theme I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna be using a fitness niche for this Amazon affiliate website. And that being said, I really like Themify's Ultra Theme. I've linked that up in the description below. I'm also using SiteGround Hosting, which is very, very fast. As you can see, everything is gonna install really quickly. I'm gonna begin by installing the required portfolio posts plugin and activate it. Next, I'm going to install all the related plugins that's required for the skin that I'm gonna use with the Themify Ultra theme. And these are all available for you free if you purchase the Ultra theme. And so I'm gonna quickly run through this process and I know it's gonna take a little bit but hopefully it'll be pretty quick again site grounds hostings awesome I'm not going to activate the builder WooCommerce from themify until after I install WordPress and I think that's all the plugins I'm going to need to contact. I actually might need the updater. So Themify has an updater plugin that you just plug in your username and your license number and you can quickly update any of your themes. Oops, I need to deactivate the builder WooCommerce until I get WooCommerce installed. So now I'm going to call WooCommerce up here. Call, I love that. I'm just going to give WooCommerce a call at WordPress.org on the back end of my WordPress website. Isn't that great? Okay, now that's activated. I'm going to activate the Builder WooCommerce. Okay, that's all done. The next thing that we are going to need to do is install one additional plugin and it's called WooCommerce external product new tab. Because what happens is if you don't install this plugin and they're on your affiliate website, it's going to open up the website in the existing tab 
and not a new tab and you don't want them to leave your website or at least if they do leave it not to close it so wc external product new tab and this is it so woocommerce external product new tab and this you just install it and you activate it and it automatically makes it so that any of your affiliate links from Amazon when people click on them to check out the pricing they open in a new tab and not in your existing tab which is pretty cool just to keep them on the site so now what we're going to want to do is check out the front end and this is what we have so far because we haven't activated our skin. So we're gonna to go to Themify Ultra, Themify Settings, and like I said, we're gonna be using the fitness niche. So we're gonna to go to Skins and Demos. They have a number of different skins, which are like basically instant websites. And all you have to do is replace the content that's imported with yours, which is super awesome. So we're just gonna go and import the Ultra Fitness. And now when we go back on the front end, voila, we instantly have a website up. So the next thing that we're going to do, and of course the map's not gonna populate until you plug in the maps API. That would be for a different video. Anyways, now we're gonna go ahead and go to WooCommerce and we're going to go to products and we're gonna to go to add new. Then I'm gonna open up a new tab. I'm gonna to go to my Amazon associate account And log in and again this is a fitness niche so what I'm going to do is go into product links and then I'm going to search exercise equipment all Amazon or let's go down to fitness they have fitness let's just type in exercise equipment exercise equipment and so here we have a maxi climber for $169 I'm gonna go ahead and right click on that and I'm gonna open that link in the new tab open it up because what I'm gonna want is I'm gonna want to grab and drop that image onto my desktop because I'm going to use that as the product image in WooCommerce. Okay, and also I'm gonna use this as the description. So now let's go ahead and get the link as well. And I want a text only link and I want a short link. And I'm just gonna leave that there for now. Now I'm gonna go back over to add a product and the product name was Maxi Climber right here so we're gonna go ahead and type in maxi climber then to the description of the climber we're just gonna grab all of that description information and plug that right there into the body for the description and then for the short description we're gonna copy this top one scroll down and plug that in the short description the next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab that product image we just drug to our desktop and put that in there into our media folder and of course you can seo it with alt text but for now i just want to quickly show you how this is done so now we have our product name product description product short description we have a product image the next thing we're going to do is on product data we're going to select external affiliate product this is where you put that url right here okay oops so we're going to go back over to get that link copy it come back paste it in here and then you leave the price blank. Amazon's terms of services doesn't allow you to put the price in there. 
So what I recommend is put check pricing and not add to cart because it doesn't add to the cart because you're going to be leaving this site into a new tab where they're going to actually see the product page and be able to make the purchase. So now make sure you select the appropriate category. I'm going to select, uh, I've already created these categories in advance. I'm going to select exercise equipment and elliptical and then I'm going to publish. And now I am going to view the product. And there it is, right there, voila. So you have the maxi climber, the image, you can click on it, get the big picture of it, see all of the information, the categories. And again, this is dummy data that's in here right now. But now all you have to do is basically customize and tailor the site to meet your needs. You create your categories, your tagging, your information, and you build out and completely add all the information on products from Amazon after you establish your account. And it's pretty cool. Click on check pricing and it leads them straight to Amazon to the purchase page for this item. Awesome, isn't it? I think so. Anyways, so that's it for five minute Monday fun day. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed the information. If you didn't, let me know. If you loved it, let me know. Like it, subscribe, comment, and smash that alert button. Webfolkster, out.